Jeff Keen here. Just got the Rivian R1T, and I wanna try this Electron Tesla the J1772 adapter. Let's see how it works. So I have a V3 Tesla wall connector. When I commissioned it, I said any vehicle can charge. Make sure that yours is set the same or this won't work. Okay, so I inserted the adapter into the Tesla handle, as it says in the instructions, waited about a minute, then plugged it in. The truck went red initially, but then it, it uh, turned white, and then I heard the Tesla charger clunk, and it started charging as normal with the green around the charger and on the front of the truck. So seems to be working good. Okay, so now I'm gonna go inside the truck. Let's see how the charge system looks. So looking here, it's charging at 11 kilowatts. Everything looks normal. I'm gonna let it complete and see how that works when we disconnect the cable. Truck completed charging, no errors. Now I just press down on the release and pull the handle out. If this doesn't work, recommission your Tesla wall connector and make sure you set it to allow any vehicle. I'll put a link for this electron adapter below if you'd like to purchase. There you go, charge completed, no problem. I highly recommend this adapter, it's working well. You know, I was thinking about getting the Tesla Tap Mini, uh, but this is way less expensive and pretty much the same size, same features. I mean, the, the Tesla Tap Mini is straight, so maybe a little easier to use, but um, for the price, I think this is great for most people. All right, I also got these uh, tow hooks, uh, good to keep in the front of your Rivian, your frunk, and uh, I'm gonna put the link to those also. Remember to like and subscribe for more videos about Rivian, Wi-Fi, and tech products.